John, what was your first introduction to football? It was at Montana State University. I was on the ski team over there. I came over from Norway on the ski team in 1962. And three years later, uh, some of the players were kicking field goals next to points right before practice started. And I used to play soccer, and I had some kind of urge for kicking a football, and I went over there and kicked a few with a toe like they all did. And then I realized that I could probably do quite well if I kicked what you call soccer style. And I did that first day, the first time I kicked the ball in years. And I moved out, and I didn't really know at the time the 50 yard was a good field goal. And apparently I did pretty well the first day because two days later I was suited up for my first football game. Do you think someday we might see a 60-yard field goal? Oh, I think so, Tom. Uh, there are several kickers in pro football that are capable of doing that right now. But you need to hit the ball real well, plus a, a good wind behind you would help. But one of these days, some of these good kickers are going to have an opportunity like that, and it may happen this year. No, you came here on a skiing scholarship. They don't let you ski anymore, do they? No, they sure don't. Of course, Brian tells me I can ski if I ski downtown Kansas City. What about skiing? Did that help your kicking? I think it did. It helped me build up my legs some, but the, the biggest thing, I think, was I learned to concentrate. The ski jumping, it really takes a lot of concentration, and the same holds true for kicking field goals. So I think it, it helped me quite a bit. Kansas City Chiefs premier place kicker, Jan Stenerud.